hello everyone welcome back to my channel in this video we'll be looking at how to convert decimal fraction to binary we have four fractions which is a b c and d so let's start with the first example that is 0 0.875 in converting decimal fraction to binary we are going to use the successive multiplication in this video so the successive multiplication simply means you multiply the fraction by two until the fractional part becomes zero or until you get the required answer. So let's multiply this fraction by two, multiplying 0 0.875 by two. 0 0.875 by two is 1.75. 1.75. With the 1.75, the decimal part is 1 and the fractional part is 0 0.75. So we pick the fractional part 0 0.75 and then multiply it by 2 again. 0 0.75 by 2. 0 0.75 by 2 is 1.5. The decimal part is 1 and the fractional part is 0.5. We multiply 0 0.5 by 2. Point five by two is one point zero. So from here we cannot multiply further because zero times any number is zero. So zero point eight seven five in binary we are going to write from down to top. So zero point eight seven five in binary is one one one. That's all for this example. And then let's move on to example B. So with the example B we have. 0 0.125 with the 0 0.125 we're going to multiply it by 2 like we did in the previous example so 0 0.125 by 2 0 0.125 by 2 is 0 0.25 0 0.25 we pick 0 0.25 and multiply it by 2 0 0.25 by 2 is 0 0.5 we pick 0 0.5 and multiply it by 2. 0 0.5 by 2 is 1.0. Now we write from down to top. That is the least significant bit to the most significant bit. 0 0.125 in binary is 100. 0. Let's move on to the next example, which is 0 0.625. With the next example, 0 0.625, we're going to multiply 0 0.625 by 2, and 0 0.625 by 2 is 1.25. The decimal part is 1, the fractional part is 0 0.25. We multiply 0 0.25 by 2, 0 0.25 by 2 is 0.5. We pick 0 0.5 and multiply it by 2 again. 0 0.25 by 2 is 1.0. So 0 0.25 in binary is 101. One. That's all for this example. But moving on to the fourth one, we have 0 0.546. So 0 0.5 forces, we're going to use the successive multiplication. We multiply 0 0.5 forces by 2. And then 0 0.5 forces by 2 is 1.092. The decimal part is 1 and the fractional part is 0 0.92. We pick 0 0.92 0 .9 by 2. 0 0.92 by 2 is 0 0.184. We're going to pick 0 0.184 and multiply it by 2. 0 0.184 by 2 is 0 0.368. 
we pay 0 0.368 And also multiply it by two. Zero point three six eight by two is zero point seven three six. And then we pick point seven three six. Also multiply it by two. Point seven three six by two is one point four seven two, and we could see the iteration is going on and on and on and on. But let's look at something here. We have zero point five four six, so five four six. So the trick we are going to use here is at least you should get three ones which is you should get a one for five a one for four and then a one for six we have had two ones such so as one and then two this zeros when you are converting it back it, everything will be zero so let's work and then until we get another one and then we pause over there so we're going to multiply 0 0.472 by 2 Point four seven two by two is zero point nine four four, and then zero point nine four four by two. Zero point nine four four by two is one point eight eight eight. So we could see we have we have three ones one two three, and when we sum up this value. We are getting a value closer to 0.546. When we continue, the iteration will go on and on and on and on. So when you find out that the iteration is going on and on and on, and then we get three ones, that will give you this figure over here. You solve the 0.546 in binary is... Zero point five four six in binary is one zero one one zero one zero 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 one. So we have zero 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 one, and that's all for this example. So now we are going to convert. 25 into binary using the successive division method so the successive division method is you continuously divide the number by 2 until you get your answer 2 into 25 is 12.5 so that is 12 remainder 1 and then 2 into 12 is 6 remainder 0 2 into 6 is 3 remainder 0 2 into 3 is 1 remainder 1. 2 into 1 is 0 remainder 1. So 25 in binary is 1, 1, 0, 0, 1. Now let's move on to the second example which is 337. 2 into 337 is 168.5. So that is 168 remainder 1. 2 into 168 is 84 remainder 0. 84 remainder 0. 2 into 84 is 42 remainder 0. 2 into 42 is 21 remainder 0. 2 into 21 is 10 remainder 1. 2 into 10 is 5 remainder 0. 2 into 5 is 2 remainder 1. 2 into 2 is 1 remainder 0. And then 2 into 1 is 0 
Ravenda 1. 337 in binary is 1010. 1010. 1001. 1001. This is 337 in binary. So 2 into 3, 2 into 136 is 67.5. So that is 67 remainder 1. And then 2 into 67 is 33 remainder 1. 2 into 33 is 16 remainder 1. 2 into 16 is 8 remainder 0. 2 into 8 is 4 remainder 0. 2 into 4 is 2 remainder 0. 2 into 2 is 1 remainder 0. 2 into 1 is 0 remainder 1. So 135 in binary is 1000111. This is 337 in binary. If you see value in this video, subscribe to my channel, hit the like button. See you in my next video.